After six months of shipping delays, stores are suddenly finding they have an abundance of products, and some of those things are being sold at deep discounts. CBS 2's Carter Evans shows us why it's great for shoppers, but potentially bad for retailers. It's just racks on racks on racks of clearance. It's Such a big surprise for shoppers burdened by rising prices. Is this really six sixty four? Was twenty one? Deep discounts across the country. It's a retail Armageddon. And retail consultant Bert Flickinger says that's good news for shoppers. Biggest discounts: uh, consumer electronics, sporting goods, on apparel, uh, clothes, accessories. It's cargo that was stuck in a traffic jam at sea during the pandemic. Well, now those ships have come in at a time when inflation is forcing consumers to cut back. Too many goods and too many stores chasing too few shoppers with too few dollars. He estimates some stores are overstocked by more than 30 percent, and there's just no place to put everything. Target recently admitted it needs to right-size its inventory, and the retailer's plans include additional markdowns. We bought 25,000 of these uh, Adirondack chairs from a national chain. The extra goods often end up with liquidators like Bargain Hunt, which discounts up to 70 percent. But this year, merchandising VP Norm Rankin is seeing something different. The condition of the product, it's never left the case. It didn't make it to the stores. It's not dog-eared or wrinkled or ruffled having been on a shelf. And goods from last year are still coming. We have been in negotiation with some large retailers on Christmas goods, almost $30 million worth of new Christmas product that didn't make it in time. When do you think we'll start seeing the deepest discounts? Deepest discounts will be between Labor Day and Columbus Day. Uh, and then uh, very big discounts right after Halloween. And when it comes to returns, especially larger items. The stores can't take it. Is that a hint for consumers here? If you take something back, you're likely going to get the money back and get to keep it? Uh, very good chance. Carter Evans, CBS News, Los Angeles.